Hey and welcome to Neverwinter with Aragon. So today we're just getting a quick patch, however with a pretty massive maintenance time. The server will be down for over 5 hours, most likely. Starting pretty much now, it's probably in maintenance by the time you watch this video, all the way until 5.30 UTC. You can see the text here, which we would get for the warning of when it's going to be down for. For those of you on console, here's another list and you can see the times as well. I don't know why they're doing a massive maintenance, but presumably just to make sure that their servers are still running at least somewhat decently. However, with this patch, we do get a few little fixes. For example, quality of life we're having from the random dungeon queue, spell play cavern will be removed it's such an expansive dungeon takes forever and if you don't know mechanics you'll end up just failing in the entire group so it's being moved to the advanced dungeon queue which currently only has tomb of the nine gods castle ravenloft and lair the mad mage as earlier in the week you can see by this notice they went and also removed the inferno citadel it didn't have very high completion rates there was a bunch of bugs in there and they want to give it another pass over and i guess make it a little bit easier to complete and so that's good news just making sure the dungeon queue is at least somewhat more completable i still think it's ridiculous having a level requirement of only five that's just crazy nobody's going to be able to complete it with a full party of level five people you're just going to have to end up hoping somebody will carry you it should be level 20 in my opinion but at least people on level five will gain access to some of this queued content and i guess they can learn early on how to queue up not exactly complete it though Along with that, in the Epic Trial, the master version of Crown of Keldegon, yes, a standard one, is upcoming. It's in the works right now. I've been testing it. There will be a patch to the doorway. So once you go and complete this first phase, killing off Palavorthine, you'll then be able to grapple across these islands, getting to the phase with Belindra and also Palavorthine. However, if you accidentally fall off, mess up your grapple or something like that, you do have a chance to come back. At least you did. You can see right here by this doorway, you can simply go and hop through this weird gap in collision. And this is going to be fixed. No longer will we be able to do this. So if you accidentally fall off while grappling or you end up falling off during the phase with Valindra and the dragon or end up permanently dead, there'll be no way you can come back. And you can see I replicate this again. You can simply go and head through that gap in the big gate there's no way you can get through the gate and anywhere else and then once you get to the far end of this arena you'll be able to grapple across and teleport onto the arena here as i was just messing with some friends and so this was kind of a friendly way if you did mess up the grapple or you end up screwing something over on terms of a push and then you'd be able to come back and as soon as you got onto the phylactery phase this would no longer be possible since you wouldn't be able to grapple anymore it wouldn't give you the grappling ability i can't show you a whole lot of this but overall that little gap here just by this area is going to be fixed again you can't access it while you're in the first phase and you can only access it when you actually trigger the fight with Vilindra and Palavorthi. So again, just a quick what's going to happen with this patch. Really nothing special and overall simply an extensive maintenance to, I guess, check that their servers are doing okay and reset them and so on. So with that said, hopefully I presented this well. If I did, consider leaving the video a like. And if you're new around here, consider subscribing. We'll see you guys around. Goodbye for now.